Transitioning now to a pressing health concern, Parkinson's disease emerges as a widespread and progressing neurological condition affecting many individuals worldwide. This disorder brings about symptoms like tremors, rigidity, impaired coordination, and challenges with balance. Although Parkinson's disease can strike anybody regardless of status, fame has not spared several prominent figures who also grapple with this incapacitating illness. In this presentation, we shall delve into distressing narratives of renowned personalities affected by Parkinson's disease, while shedding light on their resilience in confronting the diagnosis. In 2018, actor Alan Alder revealed that he had been living with Parkinson's disease since 2015. This news came as a surprise to many, but those who know Alda's story understand that it's just another chapter in a life full of resilience and determination. Born Alfonso Joseph D'Abruzzo on January 28, 1936, in New York City, Alda was drawn to acting from an early age. After serving in the Army and attending Fordham University, he began his career on stage before moving on to television and film. Of course, Alda is best known for his role as Hawkeye Pierce on the hit TV series MASH, which ran from 1972 to 1983. His portrayal of the wise, cracking, compassionate surgeon earned him numerous awards and made him a household name. But even after MASH ended, Alda continued to act, appearing in films like Crimes and Misdemeanors and Manhattan Murder Mystery. Despite his busy schedule, Alda has always found time to pursue other passions. He hosted Scientific American Frontiers on PBS for over a decade, interviewing scientists and exploring topics related to science and technology. He's also written several books, including Never Have Your Dog Stuffed and Other Things I've Learned. And if I understood you, would I have this look on my face? When Alda announced his Parkinson's diagnosis, he did so with typical grace and good humor. In an interview with CBS News, he said, I'm not angry, I'm not sad, I'm curious. That curiosity has led him to explore new ways of managing his symptoms, including boxing and speech therapy. Since then, Alda has remained active, continuing to act, speak at events, and host his popular podcast, Clear Vivid with Alan Alda. Through it all, he maintains a positive attitude, inspiring others with his resilience and determination. As he told CBS News, you have to realize that every day is a brand new day, and it's going to be what you make of it. In 2020, Ozzy Osbourne, the legendary heavy metal singer and former Black Sabbath frontman, shared some difficult news. He had been diagnosed with Parkinson's disease, a neurological disorder that affects movement. This revelation came after a series of health issues for the rock star, including a fall at home that required surgery. Despite the challenges posed by Parkinson's, Osbourne has remained open about his struggles. In interviews, he has discussed the symptoms he experiences, such as tremors and difficulty with fine motor skills. By speaking publicly about his experience, he hopes to raise awareness about the disease and inspire others who may be facing similar battles. Prior to his diagnosis, Osborne had already built an impressive career in music. Born in Birmingham, England in 1948, he rose to fame as the lead vocalist of Black Sabbath, a pioneering heavy metal band that formed in the late 1960s. With hits like Paranoid and Iron Man, the group helped define the genre and influence countless other musicians. After leaving Black Sabbath in the mid-1970s, Osborne embarked on a successful solo career. His distinctive sound and energetic performances earned him legions of fans around the world. Over the years, he has released numerous albums and toured extensively, cementing his status as an icon of heavy metal. Throughout his career, Osborne has faced his share of personal struggles, including addiction and mental health issues. However, he has always bounced back, showing incredible resilience and determination. Even now, as he navigates life with Parkinson's, he remains committed to his craft and to helping others. As Osborne continues to raise awareness about Parkinson's disease, he serves as an inspiration to all those facing adversity. His courage and honesty in sharing his story have touched many lives reminding us all of the power of perseverance and the importance of hope. Whether through his music or his advocacy work, Ozzy Osbourne's impact will continue to resonate for generations to come. In January of 2018, legendary singer-songwriter Neil Diamond made a significant announcement. After more than 50 years of touring, he revealed his decision to retire from live performances due to a recent diagnosis of Parkinson's disease. This revelation came after a remarkable career filled with countless hits and unforgettable performances. However, even with this life-altering news, 
Diamond proved determined to stay connected to his fans and his passion for music. Just two short years later, defying expectations, Neil Diamond took the stage once again. On March 7, 2020, he performed at the MGM Grand Garden Arena in Las Vegas during the Michael Jackson One by Cirque du Soleil show. Although it was a brief appearance, it served as a testament to his resiliency and deep love for engaging with audiences through song. Fans were thrilled to see their favorite musician back where he belonged, sharing his gift of music despite the challenges presented by his health condition. But Neil Diamond wasn't done yet. Demonstrating his indomitable spirit, the beloved artist delighted baseball enthusiasts when he sang Sweet Caroline during the eighth inning of a Boston Red Sox game against the New York Yankees on August 31, 2022. Appearing virtually on the stadium's giant screen, Diamond serenaded players and spectators alike. His surprise performance elated everyone present, illustrating how much joy music can bring, especially when shared by one of its most cherished contributors. Throughout his impressive career, Neil Diamond has remained committed to creating memorable experiences for generations of listeners worldwide. Even though his battle with Parkinson's disease forced him into retirement from regular tours, the iconic performer continues finding ways to share his timeless tunes and inspire others with his determination and optimism. Only time will tell what lies ahead for this extraordinary talent, but rest assured, Neil Diamond remains dedicated to nurturing the connection between himself, his music, and those who appreciate both dearly. In 2013, the music industry received some heartbreaking news. Singer Linda Ronstadt, known for her powerful voice and versatility across multiple genres, revealed that she had been diagnosed with Parkinson's disease. This devastating diagnosis brought an end to her remarkable singing career leaving fans around the world saddened by the loss of such a talented artist. Throughout her life, Ronstadt has made an indelible mark on the music industry. Born in Tucson, Arizona, on July 15, 1946, she was exposed to a wide range of musical styles, including Mexican folk songs, country, rock, and pop. These diverse influences would later shape her own sound and help her become one of the most successful female musicians of all time. Ronstadt began her professional singing career in the mid-1960s, performing with various bands before embarking on a solo career in the early 1970s. Over the next few decades, she released numerous hit albums, exploring different genres such as country, rock, Latin, and opera. Some of her most popular works include Heart Like a Wheel, Simple Dreams, and Canciones de Mi Padre. Her ability to adapt and excel in various musical styles earned her widespread critical acclaim and commercial success. Despite being unable to sing due to her condition, Ronstadt's impact on the music industry remains significant. A testament to her enduring legacy can be seen in the 2019 documentary Linda Ronstadt, The Sound of My Voice. This captivating film explores her life, career, and the countless lives she touched through her music. By weaving together interviews, archival footage, and personal stories, it paints a vivid picture of an artist who dedicated herself to her craft and left behind a rich body of work that continues to resonate today. Although Parkinson's disease may have silenced Ronstadt's voice, her contributions to music will never be forgotten. Fans can still cherish her recordings, and newer generations can discover her talent through documentaries like The Sound of My Voice. Even as her physical abilities decline, her spirit and passion for music remain strong, serving as an inspiration for aspiring artists